Lily Langtree, whose full name was Emily Charlotte Le Breton, was born October 13, 1853, in the island of Jersey, which is part of the Channel Islands in the English Channel. She would go on to become a prominent actress and a well-known figure in British society during the late 19th and early 20th centuries. Langtree began her career as an actress in the 1870s and quickly gained fame for her beauty and talent on the stage. Her first significant role was in the play She Stoops to Conquer, which garnered her critical acclaim and attention. She became a renowned actress, performing in various theaters in London and across the United Kingdom. However, it was not just her acting prowess that made her famous. Lily Langtree's striking looks and charisma earned her the nickname The Jersey Lily and made her a celebrated figure in high society. She was frequently mentioned in the gossip columns of the time, and her beauty captivated many noble and notable individuals. One of the most notable chapters in Lily Langtree's life was her relationship with Albert Edward, the Prince of Wales, who later became King Edward VII. The two became romantically involved in the early 1870s, and their affair was the subject of much speculation and scandal. Langtree's association with the future king only added to her notoriety. Despite her personal life being a source of public fascination, Lily Langtree continued to pursue her acting career with great success. She performed in various plays, including many by renowned playwright Oscar Wilde, who was actually a close friend. Lily Langtree eventually retired from the stage in the late 1890s and lived out the rest of her life in seclusion. She married multiple times, had children, managed various business interests, and she did pass away February 12, 1929, in Monte Carlo, Monaco, leaving behind a legacy as one of the most famous actresses and socialites of all time. Lily Langtree's life remains a fascinating chapter in the history of the late Victorian era, marked by her talent, beauty, and her association with the future King Edward VII, which solidified her place in the annals of British society and history. These are interesting things with J.C.